Hi guys and welcome as usual, want to share my own thoughts about the crypto world, what's happening, what's gonna happen. Today we have interesting situation, everything is quite in green after the decrease uh, of the couple last days. Uh, today we have 3.92 increase over the last day and this is quite nice. The global crypto market cap is 992 billion, less than 1 trillion. This is not... Not so good news. Uh, Bitcoin dominance is going lower to 39.4. ETH dominance 19.4. And uh, it seems like it's altcoin season, guys. It seems like it's altcoin season. But actually, actually, uh, we still, mm, the, globally, we are still uh, in the red zone for a lot of projects. Look at that list. Uh, but we have some gainers and uh, some of projects gave at least something top 50 performance over the last season of 90 days but we are um, we are in the red zone still fear and grid index shows 27 today uh, and it's just a simple fear not the extreme fear uh, but nevertheless I do think that we need to go uh, more to the neutral positions Look at that. Look at that beautiful green color all over the market. And this is quite nice. We have an uh, increase of the global market cap after decrease. And uh, we have totally green zone for, for a lot of projects. This is quite well. But we need to be ready that uh, something can change really fast and really quick. And we're going to see some some changes in the prices of uh, key cryptocurrencies so for the moment for the moment price for bitcoin is 20499 uh and uh, i'm showing you all the time i'm showing you this there's still bitcoin rainbow price chart that shows uh, where we are at the moment and we are look at that we are near to the bottom maybe it's not yet done but we are near to the bottom and this can be really perfect opportunity to jump in this uh, in this rocket. What's happening with the Bitcoin to USDT? You see that uh, we touched 25. We went lower. Uh, we was uh, we was dancing at the flat, and we fell down to 19,400. Now we're recovering a little bit. Uh, for the moment of making this video 20,535 and there is no signs of exponential growth there is no signs yet I do expect that we're gonna move uh, in the in the corridor of 22 uh, to 19 and uh, nothing will change significantly because uh, volatility is quite low right now uh, but it's interesting movement we are still underwater uh, we need to jump over 30 to to see at least uh, something from uh, from the top cryptocurrency. Ethereum is at the mark of uh, 1,597, almost 1,600. Uh, this is quite well. We can see that also it fell a couple days ago to 1,400. But right now we are recovered and uh, I do expect that we're not going to reach 1800 in the nearest future. We're going to bounce from this level uh, and we're going to dance flat around 1600. That's what I'm thinking about it. BNB. Uh, BNB is moving quite well and uh, we do have uh, slow growth right now. Mm, the pattern of uh, of movement of BNB is quite the same as Ethereum. Uh, it moves simultaneously and uh, 290 right now the price for Binance Coin. But in general, guys, uh, as for today, we're quite doing great. Uh, let's check what's happening with a week. Uh, not so bright, but not so bad. Half to half, and we have some gainers. Old Luna, this is something interesting, really. Uh, it's not bad. It's not bad. We are dancing at the same spot, but we do have some small and slow growth for for a lot of interesting projects that you can jump 
right away. So guys, uh, nothing else to say. Market is in green zone uh, on the 24 hour meeting, but uh, daily we're gonna move flat, uh, I do think. And all the gainers can uh, can change just literally in, in one hour. Uh, but everything is cool. The market is in green and this is uh, quite great news. Uh, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm not giving you any financial advices except one. Do not invest more money than you can afford to lose because this is really important. Thanks. Take care. See you in the next video. Bye.